There's a magical little site on the internet that I'm sure many people, my age and younger, know of. It's known to have lots of content, and even fan-made content, in many varieties and forms, so I decided to look up everything Weetopia related. Oh, and the site in question, it's scratch.mit.edu. This is meant to be like a game-making program of sorts, created by the Michigan Institute of Technology. It's super easy to program with, and lots of schools use it for teaching that sort of stuff. But that's not what you're interested in. You're interested in the vast amount of Metopia content, right? Well, let's get into it. I'll be honest and say that this video might not have much to it, but that isn't because there's nothing to look at, but because there's way too much stuff to look at. While game making is a big feature, Scratch also is used for animations, and some people do amazing work. But I don't want to just steal their fame, so go check out that stuff yourself if you want to see those animations. Although I'm still going to look at a few because there's lots of memes. So first up, we have something pretty popular in the realm of Metopia content on this site, which is someone trying to recreate the Metopia combat system. This one is just simply called Metopia 1 because, well, they made more iterations over time. The first one has no sounds, and as you can see, you just gotta go back and forth with your attacks. Hey though, the second one has sound! I think they just recorded it through their 3DS, but it's progress. This is Metopia Art Style Template Remix, which is what it says, a remix. On Scratch, you can take an existing work and reuse the code, making your own edits, and this seems to be part of a trend of sorts, where people draw their Metopia team and whatnot. Here's another battle system game, that's supposed to be the slime boss. Again, recorded audio, but still, audio! It's short and there's not many options, but it's nice that it was made. Oh, oh, here's something that you'll all understand being a big thing. A Metopia music playlist. So many people make Metopia music playing programs on here because, well, Metopia has an awesome soundtrack. It's also a fairly easy thing to make with just a few static buttons and plugging in the game music. Wait, the people that recorded their audio could have just ripped it from here if they wanted to. Here's a, uh, picture. People like to show off their Mii sometimes, so they kind of use Scratch like a social media, I guess. Now this one's cool, Metopia Fight Engine, just as the name implies. All the characters are like little Kirby's, and it's only one fight, I think, but yeah. It's very easy to break this one, such as just pressing the start button twice, but otherwise it's cool. It's got sound effects, options, health, animation. That's great. I don't care how well it performs, you have to remember that this is a site for learning, first time projects, and... I forgot adults with too much free time exist. Okay, I won't lie. This is hands down the best thing here. This is a recreation of, I think it's called, Taiko no Tatsujin, but only with Metopia music. Not all the sprites are there, but who cares? This works so good, with a good selection of themes from the game, and difficulties. Since it's in Japanese, I have no idea if this is a remix of some kind of template project or not, but I don't care. They still did great work on this. The only thing is that I don't know how to play, and feel like I'm doing very, very badly. But yeah, this is like, a full game. It's amazing and I'd say that it's worth playing. Back to looking for content, though. Here we can see another showcase of Miis someone made, but this is a way larger selection, and it's in a slideshow format. This one's called... The... GURP Metopia and it seems to be like a recap montage of someone's Metopia playthrough. Cool. This looks like it's an entire series. It's interesting. Some people seem like they kind of do content creation on here. Anyways though, here's one of those memes that I mentioned. Everyone stop what you're doing and look at this baby pelican. Dude, piece of gum looking mother- His soul is being weighed. Cartoon old man. So yeah. Expect those when looking at stuff. Here's another one that's kind of in a comic dub format, I guess. 
And yes, I specified dub because it's voiced. Guys, now let's start the day by going for a jog with a smile on our face. <sighs> Simple slapstick comedy. Now, I've never played Tomodachi Life, but... Would it be possible to play a little better? Why, sure, pal. I can play better. Yeah, the day is a fun day. Oh, oh, dang. This is good. This works so... Oh, now I'm sad. Here's a little animation and... Huh? It... it just keeps going. Oh, th this came up before Metopia switched it. Yep. Yeah. Still going. Utopia is a great game, and you should get it. Glad we could all agree. This here is another remix, I believe, so I won't lie. Not too impressive. They did kind of take the introduction dialogue from the original project word for word, even keeping the title. As you can see, top right, this seems to just be a music edit of the existing project, but the game itself is fun. Might play the original one later. This one here seems like another slime boss battle, and... Huh. The remix. Also, I just lost to the slime. Moving on, another combat system remake. Uh... That's a lot of game. So yeah, it's basic, and it only has Metopia music with similar options to Metopia, but it's got some nice animations, and works well enough. Here's horse pixel art. Thought it was cute. This is... Uh, Isabel default dancing to Metopia music. I don't even know how they did this. I don't think that you can upload GIFs or videos to Scratch, but uh, neat. This is a more in-depth sort of recreation of Metopia called Scratchtopia. Obviously there's no Miis or anything, but you have your map, sort of and go along the path until you run into an enemy. There's no jobs or magic, but you can just hit stuff. It's not bad. There was effort put into this, and it's cool that they made it. But one enemy seemingly had limitless health, and I couldn't get past it. This one's like super different. It's a map generator sort of thing for Otherworld from Metopia. It generates the landmass and whatnot, which is cool. This one's really interesting, just don't judge it based off the art. So this is an Undertale-style fight against a fiend, and... Okay, rude. It only has one attack, but it's guaranteed to kill you if you touch it. You can choose to spare the fiend, or kill it, which is fun. It's not super long or anything, but well thought out. This here is a cover of the Skyscraper theme, which is super cool. Here's another battle simulator, using what seems to be pictures from Metopia, and the vampire. That's a nice change of pace, from only being able to attack as a warrior. This works pretty well. I like it. This is... something, certainly. Look, I just can't read it, so I have no idea what's going on. But I think that it works? Maybe? Here's Metopia 2D, which seems to be another remix. Not bad, definitely, but there's an issue where the screen doesn't transition when you touch the end. You have to walk backwards after that. Also, the music changes to what I assume was originally there, midway through, but... Oh well. Ah yeah, here we are, Metopia Clicker. I could click normally, but... I have a left-click macro on my mouse, so... So 5,000 points and I get the Penguin Mage outfit. So I'll just do that. Wait, what? Oh, okay, it just puts the picture there. Oh well. Here's a tutorial for fighting fiends in Metopia. There's a surprising amount of variation in the stuff on here, but uh... 
Yeah. I'm not going to show a lot of it because it should probably have an epilepsy warning, and it's super long. Here's another music cover. It's from the same contest as the Mega Man one. Really cool. So yeah, that about covers the bulk of what exists here. I just thought it would be a fun video idea, and it was fun to record, so I'd say mission accomplished. However, there is one more thing. I decided to make my own contribution. Something great. Something phenomenal. Something like Picture Poker from Mario 64 DS. It, uh, doesn't actually work correctly. I didn't put much effort into it. There's visual bugs, no audio, calculation bugs. I don't really know what happened to it, but yeah. It has a gold counter that tells you how often people win at the game, and that's about it. So, with that all said and done, thank you to everybody for watching. I'm gonna go back to drumming Metopia music.